guys back to another Monday fasting cardio I think my last cardio session I did 30 minutes of hit meaning that I ran or sprinted for one minute and rested for two I mean I just did a nice little walk for this session I did a one-to-one -one ratio meaning I ran or sprinted for one minute and walked for a minute for rest so that's what I did for today's cardio session so back at it I'm not going to uh, slack on this I have eight weeks my first competition will be July 17th so I'm working out some details to make sure that I'm registered and everything because it's for a different uh, Oh, I need to go this way <laughs> it's for a different federation I guess the first one I was trying to do was NPC but in this case I'm doing WBFF so I'll leave a link down below so you guys can see what I'm talking about or what that federation is it's called world beauty fashion and fitness it's more glitzy more glamorous more me even though right now I probably look like crap <laughs> I got my bodybuilding.com hat on I have no makeup on because I don't care my goal was to sweat and work this out so I want to walk a little bit faster on my way back home because I just finished so I'm leaving out of here go have me something to eat and get on with the rest of my day <laughs> this is a Ryan Little production Yes, the apple cider vinegar. I uh, do about two tablespoons every morning. So this has actually been a good thing for me because it definitely helps with energy in the morning and it also helps with my metabolism. It does help with water weight and all those things. What you see me pulling out is my supplements. I will be talking more about those a little bit later. But um, I make sure that I have my multivitamins, my fish oil, and my biotin first thing in the morning. Um, it's the best thing for me to do. Um, it also helps me to get my first 32 ounces of water in um, just to get started for my day. And then I mix up my BCAAs. Um, I use a MyoBuild, I believe, uh, Muscle Tech BCAAs for my fasted cardio. So I prepare that so that gets me to about half a gallon. And this is the fat burner that I just decided to introduce back into uh, my prep. Uh, it's gonna be eight weeks. So this I have been using and I take only one tablet first thing in the morning as soon as I wake up. And then I make sure I prepare everything as far as my apple cider vinegar and taking my multivitamins and all of that cool stuff. And then I go for my fasted cardio or I'll go to the gym and do my fasted training and cardio. Um, I like that I did get a bike because this makes cardio a lot easier. previous 
video, I kind of gave you guys the rundown as to how I was prepping for this first show that I'm actually going to do. And I wrote everything out in my penultimate um, app that's on my iPad. So that's what I've been using. I'll try and link it down below so that you guys can use it if you plan on doing so. Um, you can follow me on my fitness pal. Um, I've been tracking everything and I started off kind of like in maintenance and then played around with carb cycling. And I don't know what I weigh right now, it doesn't matter, but I do recognize that I would need to go back to a particular diet to help me uh, lose weight a little bit faster, which happens to be this plan that I started off with my first prep. It is pretty much a low carb or ketogenic diet. And then for my training, this is what I follow. Uh, I don't follow the eating plan for this one. I just follow the training uh, for these days. And it's pretty much uh, training in high reps, high sets, and a lot of cardio. Now, as for my diet and my nutrition is concerned, that's my protein. The next video, I'm going to be more in depth on the superfood powder that I've got from the Trogics. And this is how I break my fast. I break my fast with a shake first. And this is what my meals are. I eat three meals and I have one shake. So this is pretty much what I eat. You can see this is strictly low carbs. The only time I'm really having any you know, fast absorbing or starchy or I guess sugary type carbs is in my shake when I have my bananas in my shake. But other than that, this is pretty much high protein, um, high in vegetables, green vegetables, and my very first like meal of food, it's high fat. So walnuts has been easy for me to have for my first, you know, meal and high fats. So this is just kind of the gist of what my diet is looking like right now. So I have to stay consistent. Check out my website for all of these wonderful programs that I have online. And check out the previous video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.